Hello, welcome to Intersoft Solution Tutorial Video. This video will show you on how to create a data paging in WebGrid. First, create a new website using Visual Studio 2008 application and named it as Data Paging. Then, switch to Design View and simply drag WebGrid control to the web form. It will automatically register the entire resources assemblies of Intersoft components at a time. Next, copy Northwind database from Intersoft Solutions folder. Right click on APP data and paste the Northwind database that has been copied. Then, open the smart tag on web grid control which located on the top right corner of the grid. Select new data source, and its configuration wizard will appear. Choose access database as the data source type, and click browse to get an access data file which is located in app data, then click OK. In here, you can specify which columns from a table that we wanted to use. Select star to display the whole columns. Click Next and Finish for Apply the Settings. Select Retrieve Structure to bind the data into the grid. It will be added the default of associated data source to web grid, then click OK. After that, right click on web grid and choose webgrid.net designer. Go to Paging section, set Paging Mode to Virtual Load and Paging Size to 25. Then, click OK. Finally, save and run the project. WebGrid will load 25 data initially. To load more data, simply click the virtual load icon which located on the bottom of the grid. Open the ASP.NET page, and open WebGrid.NET Designer. Set paging mode to classic paging and paging style UI to first, previous, next, last. Click OK to apply the settings. Then, save and run the project. In here, you can move between pages by clicking the first, previous, next, and last button. Also, you can use the drop-down button to switch between pages as well. Open the ASP.NET page again, and open WebGrid.NET Designer. Set paging mode to classic paging and paging style UI to slider. Then, click OK to apply the settings. Save and run the project. In here, you can move between pages using a slider. With simple settings, you can now easily create a data paging in WebGrid. Thank you for watching Intersoft Solution tutorial video. For further information, you can visit our website at www.intersoftpt.com.